Hello everybody and welcome to Romance Post Tarot. I'm about to begin here with a reading. Now this reading here is for August 12, 2020 and it is for the sign of Libra. That being said, this is a general reading so it might not resonate with everybody. So please do take what resonates with you, what feels good with you and just leave the rest of it aside. If you feel as though it does not uh, fit with your situation, it doesn't resonate, doesn't correlate, just let it be. It's a general reading, so it's completely normal. If, however, you would like to have your own private personal reading with your guidance, your questions, your answers, please do contact me at romancefultarot at gmail.com. You can also scroll down the YouTube drop box and you will find the following information on um, different types of readings that I can offer, the price list, and how to go upon to book a reading. That being said, I would like to take a brief little moment here. If you do enjoy the channel and you have not yet subscribed, please do subscribe to show your support and show your encouragement to the channel. It's very important for me and for the channel, so please do subscribe and I'd be very, very grateful. And that being said, let's begin this reading here. This reading is all about, did they cheat? This is what we want to know. You probably have some suspicions or you don't quite have any proof. We want to know and they don't want to tell you or you don't believe what they're saying. So I have here the mice, I have the fish, I have the snake and I have the dice. And I also have the skull and the knot. So we're going to begin over here. I think that this relationship at the very beginning was a gamble to begin with. Okay, so um, this was really about um, the relationship at the very beginning was really uh, a risk or a gamble. Sorry about that. So this was really about um, at the beginning of the relationship was, you know, quite um not quite troubling. This is really something that started off quite well. Um, you know, passion was there. Um, everything was there and that you didn't really want to see that perhaps there were maybe some red flags around that you didn't want to see. But I do believe that they were there. And that being said, you took a gamble onto this relationship. You thought, that's it. It's not going to happen with me or, you know, I'm going to try and let's see what happens. And you took a gamble and it was really about it's a win or it's a lose. Uh, that being said, in this case here, I do have to tell you that it's going to be a lose. Um, so I'm going to explain it to you. As I said, this was a gamble from the beginning. There were some red flags, I feel, but, you know, at the beginning of relationships, we don't see them. We just think, we see happiness, we see future, we see everything that we want to see that is full of illusions and, and beauty, but that's not really what it is you know, is always surrounding these people. That being said, um, I do believe that you do have, you know, you do have some abundance, you do have, you know, you do have pretty much whatever it is that you want around you. I do feel also that your partner is surrounded by quite a few people. I feel as though there's, um, there's quite a few, um, um, people that would like to actually be with your partner. And, um, and this, you know, this is the abundance that also your partner has. He, ha uh, he or she has, you know, many different choices. Let's put it that way. Now, this is a question that's been just, you know, eating away at you. It's been bothering your, your relationship because the truth has not been said. And this is you trying to find, um, trying to find some information, trying to find some backup to come to see your partner to discuss this. This is really about a loss. It's a theft. It's the destruction. This is troubles and anxiety. It's worry. It's really about um, slowly losing something. You're slowly losing the relationship because of this. Um, so, you know, it's just steadily getting worse because you're not getting your answers. You know something's going on. It's bothering you and they just keep lying. So, this is really something is slowly eating away at you. And what is eating away at you is what they are not saying. This is all temptations with the apples, like in Snow White, like in any fairy tale, okay? In Adam and Eve, you've got the snake and the snake is ready to attack. The snake is about betrayal. He is about lies, this snake. It's about deception, hidden things, hidden agendas. This person, your partner, he or she has motives. They have two faces. They act one way with you and one way when you're not there. So you need to be very, very careful who you can trust. 
Okay. Um, I also have over here hidden secrets can harm you, and I have um, unsuccessful plans because the plans, the beginning of the plans, are not uh, turning out. So that being said, um, I do hope that you are going to find that information that you need to confront your partner. Um, if you do have any questions, you would like to have a personal reading on your personal um, on your personal uh, situation, on your emotions, on your questions, on your guidance, please do contact me at romancefultarot at gmail.com. Um, Please don't forget to subscribe. I wish you, you know, much love, many blessings and much courage. And we'll be seeing each other uh, very soon. Well, tomorrow I have two other readings coming out. So we'll be seeing each other tomorrow. Have a great day and thank you so much for your support.